What are you doing? Well, I'm gonna go do the dishes. Leave it home! Welcome to the K-Drama Cafe. Your place for the latest, greatest K-Drama reviews and more. I'm Susan. And I'm Candace. And we are finally oh reviewing gosh. today. Yes. The King Eternal, Eternal Monarch. Monarch. We had so much fun doing the reactions to this one. We totally did. And thank you so much for watching along yes. with us. And the review is finally here. Yay! Yay! Before we get to the review, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to click that bell. Everybody ready? Ready. Let's get, get dramatized. dramatized. Once upon a time in the kingdom of Korea, there lived a noble and righteous king. Lee Gon, made king after his father's murder, feels that something is missing in his life. When a mysterious portal opens into another world, he takes a chance and crosses over. Jung tae is a feisty police detective living an ordinary life in the Republic of Korea. That is until a handsome man dressed in some sort of costume rides into her life on a white horse. Will Lee Gong be able to convince Taeyo that he's a real king and not insane? What happens when her cases start to match Lee Gong's story? Come through the portal to another world filled with magic, intrigue, and a romance fit for fairy tales. We have been looking forward to this drama for a while. Yes. We even talked about it in our very first review. And we're glad now that Lee Min Ho is back. We loved him in Legend of the Blue Sea. And we also loved him in <gasps> Boys Over Flowers. Ah! All that hair. Stole our heart. And we also love Kim Go Un, of course, from Goblin and Cheese in the Trap. We were so glad to see Lee Min Ho and her in a drama together. This was written by one of our favorite writers, Kim Won Suk. And she wrote Mr. Sunshine and Secret Garden, two of our favorites. This was directed by Baek Sang-hoon, who also worked with Kim Eun-suk on Descendants of the Sun. It was also directed by Jung Ji-hyun. And he also directed WWW. This aired in April of 2020, had 16 episodes, and they were about an hour each. The first episode was very dramatic. We don't know what we were expecting, but it wasn't the blood. And, and the sadness. And, and the fighting. There was so much going on, but it was really like engaging, and it was like, whoa! It drew us in. Absolutely drew us in. We were very excited. It doesn't all it doesn't stay at blood and <laughs> of it course was, not. It was a moment, yes. but it was it was a very impactful moment. And throughout the whole drama, it gave us the chance to come up with our own theories. Oh, lots of everything. theories. And, and it made it fun. The visuals in this drama were so stunning. The way they did the camera work. And the cinematography. It was just the beautiful. The angles of the camera. Mm -hmm. Remember when the king oh, died? Oh, yes. At the very beginning, the it snow It looked like the going, snow was going sideways. Yes. The, but it wasn't. It was going from the king's perspective. Yes. Which was really, really neat. We thought that was a really cool shot. And remember the bamboo oh, scenes. The bamboo oh, the bamboo forest scenes the bamboo and a lot of the was really cool. and all the time freezing shots. Those were really special moments in the show. They That's, showed it from above mm -hmm. the bamboo scene, and then they showed them going through the bamboo scene, which, which was, was really it was beautiful. Neat. The was cinematography beautiful. and visuals all were the fantastic. Yes, the music in this was so good. Mm -hmm. It never overpowered the drama but it just kind of flowed with the It flowed with, with it and it felt really well. And there were a couple songs that I really liked. One was Gummies, My Love. It was such a beautiful song. It was. And of course, Young Soo's Maze. That was a fantastic song. The just beautiful music when that, those moments when those two songs were fantastic for me. I loved them. Look up the OST. Lee Min Ho did an excellent job playing the king in this drama. He was out to find the truth behind his father's death. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and Diddy and Willie, you have to watch it. But he did a great job acting in this. There were some really interesting moments as the king where he's he just became the king. Yes. In this one part. His <laughs> voice. His voice. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. Freaked us. You'll out. you'll 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 understand when he gets there. <laughs> now we have Jung Tae played by Kim Go. And she is a police officer in the Republic of Korea. 
that. Yes, so she's in one dimension. In the another dimension. And the dimension. king is in the other dimension. So how do they get together? Well, he really. rides in on a white horse. What yeah. else does a king do? That's right. <laughs> she plays a tough character. It was a very different part for her because she got to really, I mean, she was using fighting skills. She was really tough and we loved that. And she this. had a little sarcasm in oh, there. Oh, yeah. She did a great she job in this role. She had a great character in this. Big shout out to Kim Kyung Nam as Shin Jae. He did an amazing job oh, as the second great. lead. Really good. A big shout out to the prime minister. She was a wild card. Oh, Is she good? Was she bad? And the grandma or Lady like, No. Lady No, who played <laughs> the kind of like the grandma part. Our favorite grandma. She's been in so many things. We love her. But, but our favorite, favorite, who just stole the oh, show, he did. was Woo Do Hwan as Young and Eun So. He did an amazing job. You would think for sure they were two separate people. It felt like two separate people. And I mean, to have that kind of, you know, range between the stoic and then the absolutely goofy. Oh, he was great. It was fantastic. Very special character in this show. And we can't forget our bad guy, oh Lee Jung Jin, gosh. who played Lee Rim. Oh gosh. He was so foreboding. Every time he was on the screen, you were like, oh, no, he's evil. With that limp, he came across <laughs> oh, with gosh. that limp. He and, was, and then oh. the music, and then everything about him, it was scary. He was a fantastic bad guy. Now this show, for some reason, received a lot of hate. Even before the drama came out, it just seemed to go way overboard. Was it perfect? No, but for some reason, it just kept getting overly criticized. Kept getting slammed. There was a lot of product placement in this show. But it didn't really bother us. We're from the US where there's like 10 minutes of commercial for every 10 minutes of We're show. We're used so. to all that commercials. Oh, oh yes, absolutely. Gosh. Oh, oh, mom, your hands seem a little dry. Oh, Would yes. Would you like some lotion? Oh, I thank you. Oh, yes. Oh, wow. It's lovely. Parallel worlds in this were lots of fun. But they created a lot of paradoxes when they brought in the time travel, and that really irked me. It didn't did, bother me. Didn't bother her. But luckily, the paradoxes didn't cause any really frustrating consequences for the storyline. Also, about the chemistry. I loved it. For me, it didn't start off really there. I was wondering if the characters would, you know, could they really be romantic interests? But as the show progressed, they really developed the characters and they've developed that romance between them and it just grew. It, it blossomed. Almost like how it happens in real life. And I was really invested in it. So, did the king transport us? To another world of romance and adventure? We really enjoyed this drama. We had a lot of fun guessing and theorizing with all of you guys what was gonna happen, and it was really a fun There thing. were so many unique characters, unique setting. And it was just a great new fairy tale. Thanks for watching our review on The King Eternal Monarch. And if you like this review and you wanna see more, don't forget to like, subscribe, click the bell. Comment below, let us know your thoughts on this drama. Did you enjoy it as much as we did? It's definitely a drama to check out. Now get, get out there and get dramatized! Once upon a time in the kingdom of Korea. Who okay, made a happy new day? And if there's any mistakes, that's totally okay. That's okay, right. okay you just put a little bit here. <laughs> Click the bell. <laughs>